It's always a treat to hear birds in your backyard, and it's even more fun when you can identify them. Here are 10 of the most common backyard bird songs and calls that you need to know if you live in eastern North America. Keep in mind many of these songs and calls are variable, and that birds make many vocalizations. These are just some of the most notable ones. Now let's get into it. Our first bird makes a coo that is recognizable by almost anyone in the United States, the morning dove. Some people mistake this song for an owl, and the morning dove call is often associated with summer days playing outside. Look for these tan birds perched up high, on platform feeders, or on the ground. Our next vocalization that you need to know is that of the American Robin, an iconic thrush with a dark back and orange breast. Its song is said to sound like cheerly, cheer up, cheer up, cheerily, cheer up. This melodic song may remind you of spring, and can often be heard early in the morning and right before nightfall. It's one of the most recognizable bird calls in North America. Next, we have the Northern Cardinal. The male is bright red, and females are tan with some reddish hues. Cardinals have several songs to know, but some of the most common ones sound like cheer, 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 purdy, 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 or just a string of downward inflected whistles. Due to their beautiful song and bright coloration, cardinals are a backyard favorite that can be seen year-round. Another bright bird to listen for is the boisterous blue jay. Known for their striking blue plumage and loud JJJ calls, they're hard to miss. Blue jays are also known for their intelligence and mimicking abilities, although they can sometimes be aggressive towards other species. Next up, we have the bright and cheerful American goldfinch. Their perchicory song is a delight to hear, especially during the summer. Some people also say it sounds like they're saying potato chip. In addition, they will also make high-pitched whistles. Keep an eye out for these bright birds on sunflowers and thistle feeders. Our next bird vocalization to know is that of the black-capped chickadee, a small and charismatic bird. Listen for their chickadee dee dee call, which is very distinctive, although they have a variety of different vocalizations that they make. Another call made by chickadees called the springtime call sounds similar to cheeseburger. These birds are extremely friendly and goofy and are always a treat to have in your yard. They especially prefer black oil sunflower seeds and are normally not too shy. The next call on our list is that of the house sparrow. House sparrows are non-native birds that have become established in urban areas of North America. They don't have a true song, but make variable chirps that can be quite noisy when they're in a group. Females are shades of tan and brown, males have lighter colored cheeks, a black bib, and a streaked dark brown back. Moving on to another well-known species, we have the northern mockingbird. Northern mockingbirds are mimics, and both males and female birds sing. They will copy the calls and songs of other species, or even man-made noises. The song is a long series of these phrases, normally repeating each one two to six times before moving on to the next.
Other birds such as thrashers make similar songs, so try to get a visual on these gray birds before making your identification. One of the loudest and most boisterous songs you may hear in your backyard is that of the tiny yet mighty Carolina Wren. Their tea kettle tea kettle tea kettle song adds charm to any backyard, and they will often perch up and sing. When identifying them, look for their rufous coloration and distinct light line above their eye, in addition to their song. Next up is the house finch, which sings a melodic song composed of shorter notes. Males and females are tan with brown streaking, and males have a red head and chest. These birds are normally seen in groups, and will feed alongside other species in your yard. They were once only found in western North America, but humans brought them over to the east, and they are now established. As a bonus bird, we have the white-breasted nuthatch, which is a yard visitor that is very friendly. Their most common vocalization is a nasal yank-yank-yank-yank-yank call. Keep an eye out for them on tree trunks or coming into feeders to steal a seed. They have a light stomach and throat with a black neck and back of a head, and a blue-gray back, tail, and wings. Thanks so much for checking out our list! Have you heard any of these birds in your yard before? Let us know in the comments below, and if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our channel. If you didn't hear a specific bird you're looking for in this video, make sure to view our Learn 25 Common Backyard Bird Calls video. And thanks for watching! We'll see you next time on Badgerland Birding. Yeah.